I'm going to make this quick because i got to pick my son up from school because I am a good father. I might not be doing everything I'm supposed to be, but I'm there. Now, I just got this reply, Willie P. Somebody bashing me. Now, I'm going to be honest with you. You saw that dumbass girl in that damn prom dress. I told everybody the dress is okay. Based on this one premise, you see that dress anywhere. It's commonplace. You see that shit on TV. You see that shit in magazines. But that just goes to show you how stupid some black women have got. Of course that shit wasn't appropriate for the damn prom. She looked like she was going to go to the pool party or something. But that's something different. By me trying to defend this young black lady, even knowing that she was dressed way out of proportion, I'm saying cover her ass up. I'm trying to say something positive, and everybody's calling her bitches and hoes. Why? Because she came off like a bitch ass hoe. She might not have been trying to, to upstage any other bitches at the prom. Young ladies, not all women are bitches. But the moral of that story is this. I tried to say something positive in defense of the girl that made the mistake, saying that the people ought to just cover her up. But in everyone's ignorance, because you just can't blame the black girl. You just can't blame the black people. You just can't blame yourself, and you just can't blame me. These people fail to realize how far the fucking ball has dropped. You know. You've even mentioned it. You can't call Willie Peter fraud for one reason. He only speaking on what he see. So in saying that, I'm always going to say, fuck you, Willie Pete. Me and you always going to argue like that. We don't always agree. But right now, I can't let nobody call you a fraud because you're speaking on your perspective. And if that's what you see, you keep on telling these motherfuckers what you see until you can't see it no more. Once you don't see these black women acting a certain way, once you feel as if, okay, now they stopped acting that way, people need to see that this is how they really are, then you're going to speak on it. But until then, don't call Willie Peter fraud. Until you see what you see, you say what you see. Tell people what you see. That'll, that's the only way you can counter, counterbalance Willie Pete is to tell what you see. I try to tell what I see and speak on. And what it got me? Motherfuckers call me pedophile because I didn't want to call a little black girl a hoe, a tramp, a pole sliding bitch. I didn't want to degrade this black woman so I became a pedophile in their eyes. How you think that fucking made me feel? Trying to defend somebody I know was wrong. I was trying to give her an out, cover her up, but no, I'm an old black man, a drunk, must be trying to get some pussy. Somebody tried to say on, their, on one of these comments, I'm going for pussy points. Pussy points for what? I got a woman at home. I'm not trying to get no pussy points. I'm trying to enlighten these sisters, try to give them something to look forward to. Somebody's going to love me out there for me, but if you keep on acting like Willie Pete sees you acting, Willie Pete gonna talk on it. And because you open your mouth, Willie Pete, that makes you a fraud. And just like any other, uh, what's the word I want? Any other um, crusade, any other topic, any other actions you want to take. You can't call somebody a fraud because. You don't agree with him. I don't agree with Willie Pete. I, so I say fuck Willie Pete. Willie Pete, you asshole. And I'm pretty sure he gonna get on his shit and say, no, you an asshole. And then three, four videos later, we both look like assholes and our points never got a cram crossed. So you gonna call somebody a fraud because you don't agree with him. I don't agree with him and I don't think he's a fraud. He might be jankety. He might be kind of funny style with the goddamn truth. But shit. He ain't got nothing good to say about y'all bitches because all he see is bitches. And yeah, I live in the suburbs too. You don't see hoes acting like this in the burbs. Why? You tell me. Not every black person is ghetto. Not every black person has to be ghetto. Niggas, wake the fuck up. It ain't just a black woman. It's not just a black man. It's the fucking BMS. The black mental situation. So you figure that shit out on yourself. I had to explain to motherfuckers why black people don't want to be called monkeys today. How the fuck you think that made me feel? So please, leave Willie Pete alone. We got bigger fish to fry, and I'm allergic to fish. You figure that one out. 
I don't like watermelon that much either. But I fuck a chicken over. So please, instead of calling people frauds, I tell you what you do. Don't call Willie Peter fraud. Hook up your video camera, look him dead in the eye and say, Willie Pete, I don't agree with your ass. Now. But you can't. You want to type in some shit faulty. You know what? I'm not siding with Willie Pete. Call him whatever the fuck you want to. But until you can hook up your video camera and do what he do, you ain't doing shit but talking. And you've been too. Willie Pete, fuck you.